today. I thought we'd go down to the Pennsylvania State Farm Show and uh, see some agriculture today. It's been a sort of a historic event here in the uh, Harrisburg area. It's the largest agricultural show in the world and they have it every year here in the middle of January. So let's take a walk and uh, see what we can find photographically. We're here to take pictures and try to find some compelling compositions. It's going to be a challenge. Uh, I've been here before to try to get photos and it's, it's, uh, it's, it's not a place you would think there'd be some compelling comp uh, compositions in here, but let's see what we can find. It'll be a challenge, but let's see what we can do. Every year they have a butter competition here where they make a sculpture out of butter. They actually craft the entire thing out of butter. Uh, somewhere there's a plaque here that tells you how many pounds of butter they've put in this thing. Let's see if we can find it. Competition. Let's check it out. Yeah. <laughs> Turn around to look for it. Oh. Jerry Putt. Jerry C. Miller. Nice to meet you, sir. You want a YouTube video here? You want to be in it? Sure. Are you a painter? Yes. I'm the artist. <laughs> so this is one you're working on now? Yes. It's uh going to be a front, it's going to be a wraparound cover for the May issue of Pennsylvania Game News. Hello, how are you? Come on in. Bill Brick. Bill, I'm Steve Miller. Hi. I'm doing, uh, a standard six step pattern and I'm into the final steps of the pattern. It's going to look like the seat when it's done. Where's the beef? Right here's the beef. I know I'm losing it somewhere. That videotape? Nice cooking. Thank you. She's kind of mad. She don't want to be here today. <laughs> She's pregnant. She's like, I'm pregnant. I want to be at home in bed. Huh. <laughs> yeah, mom. One of the biggest parts of the farm show every year is the food court. And look how big this is. This is huge.
reproduction of the 1868 Leviathan. This locomotive was built brand new, finished in 2009 by David Cloakey in Elgin, Illinois. Um, as I said, the locomotive is fully operational, built entirely from scratch by Cloakey in his shops. That is awesome. Thank you. Yep. Where are you? What's your name? Uh, my name is Chris. I'm a volunteer with Stone Gable Estates. I've been shooting around here trying to get some silhouettes of the floor about here behind me. If you get the bodies in there proper, you could get yourself a nice composition here, but uh, it's one of these which I'm not going to know what I have until I see it in the computer, so we'll see. Who, who am I with? I am Greg Knoll from, from, the, from the Pocono region. Oh, Pocono region. Yeah. And tell me, you just told me what you do here, but take a, give me a synopsis. Yeah, me. basically what we do is we start out with a solid piece of oak or cherry, and then we use uh, various cutting tools like laser cutters, uh, CNC routers, or Chester the pig design. We've got a, we cut out the pig design, put the name of the pig there, put some pig hooves there. Now what was your... Flags above here. I like the repetitiveness of them that they stack across the ceiling. But uh, I need a 200 millimeter lens, and I didn't bring it with me. I have a 120 with me. That's not, that's not quite enough, but we'll see what we can do with it. I shot it a couple of times. I knew this has been happening for a long time, happening for a long time. I didn't know it was the 103rd Farm Show, consecutive years. Well, that pretty much wraps it up for me here at the Farm Show today. But I know it's gonna be difficult just finding photographs in the middle of all this, in essence, chaos. But uh, got a few, take a look at them and see what we can do with them. We'll get them in, the photo, in the Photoshop and Lightroom. See you in the next video. Hit the subscribe, hit the bell, hit the like button. We'll see you then.